Hi folks, hope you're okay today. Uh, I want to talk about whether the Seventh Day Adventists are a cult. I bumped into a few of them in Manchester once and they were very fanatical uh, about reading the scriptures in a very um, pharisaical way. And it, it, it was not about the gospel, um, it was more about um, obeying the letter of the law rather than actually knowing the grace of God. Uh, the history of Seventh Day Adventism, Matt Slick says modern Seventh Day Adventism traces its origin back to the early 1800s to Mr. William Miller, 1782 to 1849 of Lawhampton, New York. And Matt Slick goes on to give the history of this movement. What's interesting is that there were, there's been um, statements of the end time given by the leaders and uh, it's been false um, so that alone should send alarm bells um, I would suggest that you stay away from the Seventh Day Adventists they are dangerous um, they are not preaching a clear gospel they are preaching more of a rabbinical kind of religion where it's about deity laws it's about your outward appearance rather than your heart and your relationship with God